Well, according to the Chinese Zodiac, we have just entered the year of the pig. And here in the Mayor's Gallery at the historic Fifth Street School, the pig is being honored in many forms. weeks, the mayor's gallery here at the historic Fifth Street School was a real pigsty. Well, it was filled with pigs of all shapes and sizes, even one that showed pigs sometimes do fly. It was the latest art exhibit honoring the Chinese year of the pig. Local artists really showed up to show off their pieces honoring the pig in all its glory. Like this piece, showing that at least in the Chinese zodiac, pigs and tigers are an unlikely compatible pair. The pig is associated with other signs that is more compatible than other signs. And uh, the, the sign of the tiger happens to be one that's compatible with the pig. And so that's why I call them the lovers. And, uh, and then the pig is standing on a daisy, which is designated as one of the flowers uh, associated with the year of the pig. Stuart Freshwater also subtly included what the Chinese refer to as door gods in this piece. Every Chinese New Year, it's a custom for families and businesses to put uh, door gods on the outside of their houses or businesses, and uh, it's to protect them from evil spirits and things like that. And, and uh, so, so I put some door gods kind of up in the clouds to represent that part of the, the custom. Audrey Fox said she was thrilled to be invited to participate in this show and wanted to have some fun with the piece she created. Uh, my painting is called I Have Mixed Feelings About Pigs and I wanted to make this a satire and used a lot of the symbols that represent the pig. For example, the piggy bank and the pig likes to eat, of course. So we have a lot of Chinese food here. And I've also incorporated the flower that represents the pig, which is the hydrangea. And I wanted to make this a satire. So one of the paintings here is a pig on a blanket, which is a pun, as well as a flying pigs, do pigs fly? And then money is also a symbol of the Chinese year of the pig, abundance. She chose to use acrylic paint and used a technique to illuminate the canvas. I started with this banana yellow color because I wanted the painting to have a lot of luminosity. So the painting is all um, first painted with this beautiful yellow banana color and then I added layers on top. From clay pigs to carved pigs, so to speak, the exhibit showed a wide variety of the various forms of art and the depth of talented artists we have right here in the city of Las Vegas. I just really appreciate the city of Las Vegas providing artists the opportunity to take part in this show and uh, Jeannie Voltura especially who uh, curates the show and gets it organized and uh, it's really a, a good community thing that the city does here. I think that there's so many amazing interpretations of the pig in so many various mediums. There's so much content here. The way people interpreted the pig and using the Chinese symbols was very entertaining. The Year of the Pig exhibit is coming down. Another one is coming up very soon featuring watercolors. For more information on that and anything arts and culture going on in our city, go to artslasvegas.org.